in health news tonight, a breakthrough cancer research linked to a plant that can be easily found here in the New England area. Now we're talking about a specific fern and its impact on brain cancer. News 8 medical reporter Jocelyn Momenta in our New Haven newsroom with more on a significant study going on at Southern Connecticut State University. Jocelyn. Sonia and Darren, the focus of the study is the Christmas fern, which is a North American, American native plant. Longtime researcher cancer research Dr. Sarah Crawford at SESU has discovered that it has an active component that can actually help to shrink brain tumors. After seven years of research, she now has a patent for it. The Christmas fern is a familiar plant to many of us, but not known until now is its link to brain cancer. It's a primitive plant. It has uh, antioxidant chemicals that are not found in more complex species. Dr. Sarah Crawford, who heads up the Cancer Biology Research Laboratory at Southern Connecticut State University, made the discovery. And I have tested other species of fern, but so far this seems to be the most potent. Dr. Crawford concocted a potent triple cocktail using the extract of the fern and combining it with the chemotherapy drug Carmistine and the anti-inflammatory curcumin. Tests showed it killed an aggressive form of brain cancer cells grown in the lab, the same type of cancer that claimed the life of the late Senator Ted Kennedy. So to see 50% killing was actually extraordinary considering the fact that this is basically a disease for which there is no treatment currently. This is a solid tumor that when treated with a triple concoction. And here you can see a dispersed tumor and many of the tumor cells are dead. Still, it is far short of Dr. Crawford's overall mission. There are little remnants that may continue to seed and form a new tumor. Unfortunately, if there's anything left, there's always a chance of regrowth. Recently granted a patent by the U.S. Patent Office for the fern extract, she and her students are now tweaking the protocol. We want to uh, do more than simply give a several month extension on life. Uh, the goal here really is to develop a clinical approach that will have some real long-term treatment value for patients with brain cancer. Dr. Crawford shares that patent with a former student. She is optimistic that a phase one clinical trial will be a reality within a year. For more information, log on to our website, WTNH.com. Darren and Sonia.